Hello, I'm Patricia Silva with your SCB News Break for Monday, July 31st. After only a day of deliberation, a jury convicted Robert Arvizu for the first-degree murder of his wife. Courtney Arvizu was found dead in the couple's home due to blunt force trauma in May 2015. Arvizu was arrested the following day after deputies connected him to Courtney's death. Arvizu faces up to 30 years due to the conviction. Four SCV nonprofit arts organizations have been awarded grants by the LA County Arts Commission. Canyon Theater Guild, Santa Clarita Ballet, Santa Clarita Master Chorale, and the SCV Youth Orchestra Foundation all received grants, which totaled to be over $78,000. Canyon Theater Guild received $27,400. Santa Clarita Ballet received $20,900. Santa Clarita Master Chorale received $17,400. And the SCV Youth Orchestra Foundation received $12,600. The County Arts Commission is distributing grants through its organization grant program. The program provides support to ensure arts organizations are able to provide cultural services for the diverse population that makes up LA County. We're going to take a quick break, but when we come back, find out what TV shows and films are filming here this week. Plus, a special honor was given at the 2017 Silence Under the Stars. Find out more after the break. They'll test you. Try to break your will. But however loud the loudness gets, however many cheese puffs may fly, you're the driver, the one in control. Stand firm. Just wait. And move only when you hear the click that says they're buckled in for the drive. Never give up till they buckle up. The earthquakes you see in movies are one thing, but real life is a completely different animal. Just because you can't predict an earthquake doesn't mean that you can't prepare for one. In the event of a real earthquake, you should drop, cover, and hold on. Visit ready.gov slash earthquake and practice what to do to keep you and your family safe in the event of a real earthquake. And you'll be seen as a hero by your family and your loved ones. Visit ready.gov slash earthquake today. Welcome back. Films, television shows, and reality shows are filming right here in Santa Clarita. See if your favorite shows will be filming here with this week's edition of In Production. Former superintendent of the William S. Hart Regional County Park in Newhall was honored at Saturday's Silence Under the Stars. Norm Phillips was recognized for his more than 30 years of service to the park. Santa Clarita Mayor Pro Tem Lorene West presented Phillips with a custom-made branding iron as part of the recognition. The iron came with a WSH logo for William S. Hart. Phillips is now the second recipient of the Special Lifetime Achievement Award. He shares the title with former supervisor Michael D. Antonovich. Now taking a look at weather, a heat advisory has gone into effect from Monday to Tuesday evening. Temps will be high, reaching into the hundreds both days. On Wednesday, there will be a high of 98, and that's coupled with a 20% chance of thunderstorms throughout the day. The chance of thunderstorms will last through Thursday. On Friday, conditions will clear up and will leave a high of 99 and low of 70. That's all for your SCV News Break. For more local news, you can log on to hometownstation.com or scvnews.com. Thanks for watching. I'm Patricia Silva. Thank you.